Hey guys, so this is going to be a product review. Um, it is of the Clean and Clear Finishes Mattifying Moisturizer. Um, as you guys know, if I haven't said it or you, it's pretty, it's a pretty obvious observation. Um, I have really oily skin. Um, I wash my face very frequently, and I also use an astringent with uh, cotton rounds to try to minimize the um oil and shine on my face so when I saw this moisturizer in the store I was very excited because it it says that you know it has super absorbing minerals and complexes that control sh shine all day and so I saw it and I was like yeah let's try this out so of course you're supposed to give stuff a a good little while just to you know see if it works on your skin um I got it from Walmart and it was it was about six something but I also had a dollar off coupon that I got out of my Sunday paper but if you don't like get a Sunday paper some what am I saying sometimes at the store you can see there are products that have like a dollar off coupon right there on them just peel it off and take it I've done it before but uh, clean and clear had a coupon for a dollar off so I got it for like five something and on average a moisturizer will cost you about seven six or seven dollars I think so I'll go ahead you know I'll try it I don't know I keep looking at that I'm sorry guys um I said I'll go ahead and try it because you know this is the I thought the solution to my ongoing um problem of oily skin so I uh got it and first off the consistency I'll show you guys it's very watery you, you see it's like really really watery so I didn't start off using a lot like I didn't use a lot and I rubbed it into my skin and I will show you guys something that I did not like right off the bat I'm trying to rub it in but as you can see um, and that's you know I'm show you guys I'm rubbing it in that it leaves a ghostly little uh, grayish whitish tint on your face now I'm not sure if this product was not um, you know made for women of color or people of color but um, I really don't want a ghostly tint on my face and that's just you know kind of you look odd if you're leaving the house with a little white tint on your face so that right away kind of threw me off like what is you know that but um it does go away after some time but the product goes away after some time um i would say probably within the hour there was there was no all day shine it i mean there was no all day you know shine control it was about an hour and my face was you know back to the way it was and i don't know if that's because i feel my face is in hyperactive hyperdrive or if the product is just like not what it claims to be because I'm still like rubbing it in it's still a little bit I don't know so it just really did not uh, give me what I thought it would um, even though I have oily skin you're always recommended to have a moisturizer in your um, regimen but I guess oil and moisture are two different things but my face has never been I don't know this did not make me feel like I was moisturized versus you know just a regular oily face so I can't really give this product a good rating I have to give it I'll give it a two because I never want to give anything like a zero but it just really did not work for me and I don't know I was very excited about it it does have a face wash that um, goes with it so maybe I have to try that to see you know if they work together or something but I don't know the face washes that I use clean my face but it's just something that my face is just always oily uh, yes I drink water um, I've tried to consume way more water than I did before my dad gets on me about that um, he has forever and I'm doing a lot better reducing oily foods in my diet I've done that as well and it really isn't that my mom has the same oily skin so don't know what it is but we are trying to figure it out but this did not help and it says it won't clog pores I really don't feel like I had a problem with any breakouts with the product but it definitely didn't really help with what it was supposed to 
Um, it is SPF 15, so it's a nice sunblock. I'm going to show you guys how the bottle looks. And it came in a, like a little pink box, but I lost the box, so I could show you guys. So this is how it looks. And it's 1.7 ounces. I don't know. Definitely go uh, to, you know, any local drugstore, Walmart, Target, or anywhere like that. I'm sure they'll have it uh, right next to their other moisturizers and, like, face washes. So, um, that's it, you guys. Uh, I wish I would have been able to give you a better review of this product. Meaning, I would rather give it a nicer rating, but it didn't work for me. So, alright, see you guys.